I miscarried during a concert. Halsey is speaking out about suffering a miscarriage during a live performance earlier on in her career. The Bad at Love singer recalls the horrifying experience on the August 6th episode of the SheMD podcast. I think you had a miscarriage once yeah, on stage. I miscarried during a concert. What? Yeah. Yep. What yeah. happened? I I started miscarrying before the show. Did you know? I knew. And I was like in a really I was in a really tough position because it was really early on in my career and there was a lot attached to the show. So there was, you know, a like a corporate partner, there was like a greater media entity partner. But more importantly than that to me, there was like a thousand kids who waited all day long to get into the show and see me. The 29 year old says she didn't have much time to process what was happening to her ahead of performing the 45 minute set. What ended up happening was I ended up just putting on like an adult diaper and I went and I did the show. I left stage, I threw up in the parking lot, I went to a hotel and I was sick all night. I remember laying, I remember sitting in the bathtub because I just didn't know what to do with all the blood. You know, forgive me for being so no. graphic. The singer details the aftermath of the experience and shares that she immediately had to begin another day of traveling after. I remember thinking to myself, I'm 20 years old. Like I should be able to carry a baby. I didn't want to be pregnant. I was way, you know, involved in my career. But I was, you know, so I had a, a lot of complex feelings of like relief, but also confusion, but also guilt and also grief. Halsey, who's currently dating Victorious alum Avin Jogia, explained she had several miscarriages, but eventually discovered she had endometriosis. I had a big burning question in my mind, which is something must be wrong with me because of all the times in my life where I should be able to conceive and carry to term, this is the age. The New Jersey-born singer, who also was recently diagnosed with lupus, goes on to explain she had no problem conceiving her now three-year-old son and is grateful for the doctors who helped examine her reproductive health. She's hoping that by opening up about her story, it'll help other women who are going through a similar health journey.